two Monroe County business owners are heartbroken after a fire burned down their new business on Saturday. 41 NBC's Brick Nelson has more. It's, it's like having a dream and watching your dream just go up in flames. It was heartbreaking. A dream turned into ashes. That's what co-owner of the Bulldog Sports Complex, Jamie Maurice, had to say after his building burned down over the weekend. Bulldog Sports Complex was an indoor baseball and sports training facility located on Brooklyn Avenue in Forsyth, and it just opened on April 1st. Maurice said he was devastated when he got the phone call. Uh, we closed up shop, turned everything off and left, and by about 1, 1.30, we all got a phone call that our building was on fire. And by the time we got here, it was a total loss. The City of Versailles Fire Department arrived to the scene Saturday afternoon and reported flames and heavy smoke through the roof of the sports complex. Fire Chief Kevin Bunn says no one was injured during the fire, but everything inside the building is a total loss. It's an older building built in the 50s. It was, used to be a car dealership, and it's been all kind of stuff since then. But it's um, older construction. Called a, it's got a bowstring roof in it, so it's a super dangerous old building. And so we didn't let anybody go in it. It was too far along. There was no life in danger. Maurice says even with the loss of the building, he plans to rebuild from these ashes. Just know that we're going to push bigger and harder, build a bigger building. We're going to do it times times two, and it's going to be called Bulldog Sportplex 2.0. In for Scythe, Brick Nelson, 41 NBC News. And according to the Forsyth Fire Department, the cause of the fire has been listed as non-determined. Bulldog Sports Complex is asking for prayers from the community as they rebuild.